Just a couple of weeks ago, I did a video showing you some of the best silver you could be stacking today and some of the worst silver you should be stacking as well. Today, with silver prices continuing to go up, and right now as I record this video, silver is over $28 per ounce. I thought it would be a perfect opportunity to actually go over the numbers. So I went online and I scoured all of the online retailers and I found the highs, the lows, and the averages of 90% silver, generic silver rounds, 10 ounce silver bars, silver eagles, and four different types of sovereign silver. Today, I'm gonna show you based on the numbers what is the most expensive and least expensive silver to stack today with higher spot prices. Let's do it. My channel is sponsored by sdbullion.com. New customers can get their first order of gold or silver at spot by going to sdbullion.com forward slash new. So we're going to start off with the most expensive type of silver that is considered a stacking silver. In other words, what you buy in quantity, not just one to collect. The most expensive today is far and away your American Silver Eagles. Now, I checked multiple online retailers. In fact, I did eight different online retailers today to get you the highs, the lows, and the averages. With Silver Eagles, the most expensive Silver Eagle I found of those eight retailers was $8.99 an ounce over spot. Now, other retailers had them much cheaper. In fact, the lowest was $5.20 an ounce over spot, meaning our average today on our Silver Eagles of all the shops that I checked was $6.93 an ounce over spot for Silver Eagles. The premiums on Silver Eagles, as I hinted at just a week or two ago on this channel, seem to be turning around and going back up. $5.20 was the lowest I could find just a couple of months ago, you could find Silver Eagles as low as $3.99 or better. Now, the second most expensive type of silver that we have on our table here is actually Sovereign Silver. So I'm actually gonna show you all four different types, but before we show you the four different types that I have here, let's take a look at the averages. So the most expensive type of Sovereign Silver of the four that I'm doing is $5.99 over spot. That was matched by the Maples and the Ruse. The cheapest was $2.70 over spot. That was your Silver Britannias. And the average of all of them, of all eight shops, of all four different types, so that is 32 sample sizes, the average of all of them is 437. But we can get a little bit more detailed. So the most expensive of these four was the Maple at $5.99 over spot for the high, but the lowest was $3 over spot, leaving us with an average of $4.56. Kangaroos, same high, $5.99 over spot for the high. The low was $2.90. The next one we have is our Cougarans. The high on these was $5.49. The low was $3.08 with an average of $4.37. And finally, the cheapest with the high of $5.49 was the Silver Britannia but the low was $2.70 with an average of $4.10. And one thing I'll tell you about the four different types of sovereign silver, of all eight shops that we looked at, the same exact shop had the low on all four and the same exact shop had the high on all four. On all other types of silver, it was all over the board. Different shops had highs, different shops had lows. But as far as the sovereigns are concerned, we had the same shop with the lows and the same shop with the highs. And I will tell you that the high was quite a bit higher than the other shops. In fact, as you can tell, with an average of $4.37 and a high of $5.99 or $5.49, you can see that high is much, much higher than the average. Now, the third cheapest type of silver to stack right now is 90% silver. Now, I've been covering 90% silver quite a bit on the channel recently. One thing I'll tell you is today, we are not looking at what you can turn around and then sell it for. We're not looking at buyback prices. We are just looking at what you can add to your stack in bulk, and 90% silver was our third cheapest. Now, looking at 90% silver, the highest shop on our chart was $3.71 an ounce over spot. Not per face value, but per ounce. In other words, I took what they were selling it for times face, multiplied it by 1.4, and then subtracted spot price from that. So we had 371 over, but the lowest shop was only $1.83 an ounce over spot. Our 90% silver averaged out to $2.72 per ounce over spot. Next after that, in a very close second, in other words, it was only a couple of cents off, 
was your one ounce silver generic rounds. We're talking buffaloes and other designs that you can find on online retailers. Buffaloes were basically the exact same price as your 90% silver. So your silver rounds, we had a high. Our highest price was $3.89 an ounce over spot for one ounce rounds. Our lowest price was $1.75 an ounce over spot with an average of $2.70 per ounce. Now, keep in mind, I will also tell you, just so you know, that when I'm looking at these numbers with these online retailers, I am looking at the 1 to 19 ounce price. In other words, their most expensive price that they have, and I'm looking at the check and wire price. So I am not looking at what they charge for credit card fees or Bitcoin or whatever you're going to pay with. I'm just looking at that check wire 1 to 19 ounce price for every single one of these. Finally, we have our 10 ounce silver bars. These obviously are the cheapest, but it's not a massive difference. Believe it or not, 10 ounce silver bars are $2.40 an ounce over spot on average, but their low is only five cents cheaper than the low on one ounce silver rounds. So we had a low on one ounce silver rounds, like I had said, of $1.75, but our low on 10 ounce silver bars was $1.70. Now the averages are a little bit different. The average came out to $2.40, versus 270 for the silver round. So there were some shops that were quite a bit higher on rounds than they were on bars. But on, you know, but the low, if you were to look around and find the low, it was only five cents off per ounce. And many people may think it's worth paying five cents more per ounce to divide their 10 ounce silver bars up into one ounce silver rounds. And to be honest with you, I would agree with those people. If I had the option of paying, you know, 175 an ounce over spot for rounds or 170 an ounce over spot for 10 ounce over bars, especially generic ones like these Buffalo bars, I would probably just choose the rounds because, you know, for five cents an ounce, you may as well have it already divided up. So that way, if you do need, and I know we shouldn't really be selling our silver unless we have to, but if you do have to sell your silver, it's already divided up for you. Maybe you don't have to sell 10 ounces. You only have to sell one or two. You get the idea. So anyway, that's why I think rounds, even though you can find 10 ounce bars a little bit cheaper than rounds, I still think rounds are the better buy than bars. Of course, that's a personal opinion. Now our high on 10 ounce silver bars was actually the same as silver rounds. The high on 10 ounce silver bars was $3.49 and over spot, which was the same retailer that had our high price on one ounce rounds. So clearly today's winner, if you're looking for the cheapest silver to get and you're looking for something smaller than say a kilo or a hundred ounce bar, obviously those are gonna be cheaper than 10 ounce bars even because you can get them very, very cheap, especially hundred ounce bars I have seen as low as a dollar over spot. But if you're looking for the cheapest, smaller divisible silver, 10 ounce bars and even one ounce rounds are definitely the winner today. Taking a look at the extremes, I wanna point this out to you. I hope you're still with me for this. You know, the cheapest Silver Eagle from the cheapest online retailer is still quite a bit more expensive than 10 ounce silver bars. I am actually souring on Silver Eagles once again. Just a few months ago, earlier this year, I said I was buying Silver Eagles again, but looking at what's happening in Silver Eagles, seeing the premiums move back up again, I'm starting to once again move away from Silver Eagles because again, our cheapest retailer for Eagles today was $5.20 an ounce over spot. For that money, I'll just go out and buy more rounds because again, if you have limited cash, you wanna get the most silver you can for your money, well, Silver Eagles really aren't the way to go today, even if they do have a higher premium when you go to sell them back. I'd love to know what you think though, so leave a comment down below. If you guys like this video and you wanna learn more about silver stacking and precious metals and the physical market, please subscribe, it really helps me out. The next thing you should do is watch this video right above me if you haven't seen it yet. And other than that, have a great rest of your day. We'll see you next time.